All right, this is Andrew with Zoda Home Inspections. We're in Bountiful today doing a sewer scope. Today is January 5th, 2022, 23 rather. We are at 1628 South, 500 East. We've got the camera pushed out 81 feet to the city connection. Now we're going to pull it back and record it to see what we find. So this first connection point is called the nose on. This is where it goes from the lateral line into the main city line. Looks like a good connection point there. It transitions pretty quickly to clay pipe. You can see the red terracotta color. A little bit of an offset here where the pipes have slipped. Uh, you can see there's already waste stuck on that offset. Um, I'd say that's a medium sized offset. Um, but what can happen is waste will get stuck just like it's already done and then if that continues to hold waste it can create a blockage and that can lead to a backup in the house. Uh, some small roots there. It'd be best to have those jetted out to prevent waste from getting stuck on them. There's a pretty big root. So even more reason to have the line hydro jetted. Ooh, giant root here. Um, it's there's no way you'd be able to use this line without it uh, backing up. I mean, probably immediately. You can already see there's waste stuck on it. Um, I didn't see that pushing out because there was so much standing water in the line. There's another huge root. Um, those are big enough that it's covering. There's a third one. Basically, the entire line. There's a fourth one. These are huge roots. Um, this one. I would recommend once this line has been hydrojetted, there's a sixth one, once this line has been hydrojetted to have it scoped again, that way you can see the areas that are being blocked by the roots and make sure there's nothing else going on in those areas. That one's not so bad. That Even if I had seen that without the others, I would recommend having it hydrojetted, but nowhere near as bad as the other ones. Uh, now we just transition to cast iron. This is what's underneath the house. Cast iron gets really rough and rusty. It'll eventually need to be replaced. You want to avoid putting wet wipes or feminine hygiene products down the line. Even if the wipes say they're flushable, it's not good to put them down your line because they can still get stuck. Um, I'm accessing the line through a clean out underneath the basement bathroom sink. I'm going to end this recording now.